So how do MEPs choose who gets to be the next head of the European Parliament, the EU's only directly elected institution? Here's a quick reminder with everything you always wanted to know but were afraid to ask. MEPs will vote by secret ballot next Tuesday. There can be up to three rounds in which a candidate needs to secure an absolute majority. Now, in the European Parliament, that means a majority of all MEPs, including those absent or not voting. There are 751 of them, so the magic number is 376 votes. And what if there's still no winner? Then MEPs will vote for a final fourth round with the two top candidates from round three. The winner needs only a simple majority this time, just a majority of those parliamentarians present. If there's still a tie, the older candidate will get the top job.